Welcome to Virtual STEM Club, You Light Up My Life. I'm Sandy, and today we are going to make a Valentine that is electrified and is going to be shining bright for someone whose day you'd like to make. You should have picked up your take and make bag, and in that bag you will find the following supplies. In your take and make bag, you're going to find a Valentine template, one battery, two paper clips, two lights, a length of copper tape, and then from home, you will need a pair of scissors. The first step for our project today is going to be cutting out one of these templates. And you can choose whichever one you like. The other thing you could do if you want to make a change to it is you could cut out a separate heart and glue it on the inside to cover up these words. Whatever you think will be fun for you. So we'll take our scissors and this thinner outside line is the one that you want to cut around. Don't cut this one because that's the line we need to put our copper tape on. So just cut out your heart. And it just takes a minute to go around this. Just cutting. And just keep cutting until you've got it all cut out. And then just slow down. You can need to here in the middle to make your point. And once you're done, it's going to look something like this. And then you can set your scissors and the template aside. All right, so then you're going to have start a new Valentine. The next step that you're going to do is you're going to take one of your light bulbs. So we did give you two light bulbs because sometimes they don't always work. So if you have one that doesn't work, now you've got a spare. When you look at these light bulbs, I'm hoping you can see on camera, one of the legs is just a little bit longer than the other. And that's the side that we're going to put on the positive here on your template. You'll see a little plus sign here and a negative sign here. And your plus sign is going to be the longer leg of your light. So what you want to do is just take your light and gently bend the legs apart. And just kind of fold them just kind of down away from the bulb like that. And so... Um, the other thing is you might want to round them just a little bit to follow the line on the template a little bit better. Just always remember which one is your long one and which one is your short one. So then the next thing you want to do is take your copper tape and find an end that will peel away. It's kind of oh, squiggly here, and I don't need that. So, you'll take, pull the white backing of the copper tape away from the tape, and you're going to start in the shorter part of the template, and you're just going to press 
your copper tape down right in the center, covering this thick line on the template. And to make your corner, whoops, if you tear it, that's okay. If you do tear the copper tape, you just want to make sure that you're overlapping enough so that your electricity from the power in our battery can make contact. So we'll just go back over that a little bit. And to make a corner, you're going to fold the tape back in the opposite direction. And then you're going to make it like a triangle. And it will adhere. I don't know if you can really see that on the, the screen. But that allows us to kind of turn the corner for our template. And then we're going to do the same thing. We're going to come up this little leg. And we're going to fold it back. And then turn a little bit. It'll make kind of a triangle again in the corner there. It will come around and just press your copper tape along the line. And if you need to kind of fold it a little bit to follow the line, you just kind of do it like that. And then again, when we get here, you're going to, when you get close to the spot on your template where the light should be, you go ahead and set your light. And then keep coming with your tape and making sure that your tape is centered over the leg on your light. So you want to press it down really good and then you will cut right here so that your tape ends right there right up next to the light bulb and then make sure that you're I don't know if you can see the little bump here where the leg of the light is but make sure that's covered really well tape like this it's okay to trim it off and sometimes it makes it easier to start your next step if you do that so all we're gonna do is just start where we left off on the other side of the light so we'll start right here pressing our tape down good around the leg of the light and then uh, just keep pressing your tape and kind of just tucking it around the curves and we're to the corner in the middle of the heart so we'll make that turn we'll fold the tape backwards and kind of crease it and then come forward and just keep working it around press it down and again if you tear it if you're pressing and pulling too hard that's okay you just go back over it make sure you overlap your tape like i'm doing here and just keep doing, going around the circle, smoothing out the tape. And it's going to be really hard to make it all smooth because it's a circle. So just kind of 
that's it. And if you tear it, just start over. Overlap it. Come down to this corner. Fold it backwards like this. And then fold it forwards like this. And you're going to end right here where the tape ends in the middle of this band, the circle. You're going to end your tape. You'll take your scissors. And cut. The next step will be to take your battery, take it out of the package. If you kind of push on this side, it should pop open. And I'm going to go ahead and test mine before I secure the battery down. So we're going to put the battery here in the spot, you're going to want, when you actually secure it down, you'll want to make sure it's on this side. But I'm going to fold our little flap over here. See how this is kind of squared? We're going to fold this, make a little crease there. Set your battery here. And then when you touch, it should work, and if it doesn't, a couple of things, and I'm going to check because I suspect I uh, flipped my light legs around, so I'm going to fix that first and see if that makes my valentine work, and then we'll go from there. So I'll just peel the tape up. tape since I moved those. I'm going to put a little bit more tape just to secure them. Let's see if we can get this one in a circuit. See what happens now. We'll try our battery again. And there we go. All right. To secure our battery into our template, you could just take a piece of your copper tape, fold it, make a little loop, and fold it and then stick it on the back of the battery. Hold it down, and there you go. And now your battery will stay attached to the project. And with your paper clips, you can put them right over this little tab, and that will hold it in place and keep your light lighting. I hope you had fun with this project. I sure did. Thanks for joining us for the Light, You Light Up My Life Virtual STEM Club program. I hope you had fun making your electrified valentine. We'd love to see any pictures or video of you doing this project, and you can share them at the email address on the screen. See you next time. Bye.